Hey guys, I'm Nick aka The One Only Nick's Games, and today I'm going to be teaching you how to install too many items and Optifine at the same time. Now first off, I do want to mention these have to be compatible with the same Minecraft version. For example, Optifine Ultra HD for 1.7.5, and we need to download too many items for 1.7.5. We do not need the 1.7.6, we need the 1.7.5 version. Nevertheless, let's go ahead and download both of those. Optifine 1.7.5 Mirror, it'll take us to this page, and then we can click Download, and it'll be right down here. We need to keep that file. Then after that, we can go over to Too Many Items, download the 1.7.5 version of that, Wait three seconds or five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. After that, we can then click skip ad. It'll take us to this and download too many items. Close out of that. And now here you have both of your mods. Now, what we want to do is we want to actually install Optifine manually. Now, you do not have to do this. I'm just choosing to do this because I want to show you guys how to install mods manually and so you know how to do this and I want to make some precautions so you guys don't end up messing up Minecraft version so first off we need to hit Windows key R and then type percent oh, that's dollar sign percent a p p d a t a percent enter once you do that it'll go to something that looks about like this but you'll see dot Minecraft go into that and then go into versions we then want to right click on the version that both of these mods are compatible with, in that case 1.7.5, and we want to basically redo that. So we want to right click on it, copy, right click here, paste, and then it will say copy. We want to rename this, so right click rename to 1.7.5 underscore mods. Now you want to control A, control C. You want to copy that. And then you're good to go. You go in here and you rename both of these to also 1.7.5 underscore mods. Then we need to go into this file. It's a .josn file. It should open with notepad. And then we'll make this a little bigger for you guys to see. But you see right up here where it says ID 1.7.5? That's not what we're looking for. We need to select that and then again paste in 1.7.5 underscore mods. File, save, and we can close out of that. Now we can actually get into installing our mod. So first off, we need to right click on this and we need to open with WinRAR. And you do need WinRAR for this tutorial. A lot of times you do not need WinRAR for this tutorial. You absolutely need WinRAR. I promise you. So you can go to the description, download WinRAR. Really, really easy. Just like installing any other program. Nevertheless, once you've got this open, we then need to go to this other .jar over here, which is 1.7.5 underscore mods. Right click on that, and then we need to, ex or not extract, open with WinRAR Archiver. So here are both of our WinRAR files. Make this a little bit bigger for you guys. And now, as you can see, a lot of this copies over, okay? A lot of it copies over with Optifine and the normal Minecraft versions. So what you want to do is you actually want to select all of this right here, right, all of it, it's going to go all the way down and drag it over. Now, if there's anything like this right here that needs to be clicked OK or whatever, go ahead and click that, click through. Now, you need to go back up to the top, go into the Assets folder, and then go into the Assets folder, and go into the .minecraft, and then go into this. You need to copy these and put those right there. It's then going to go through all this, and it'll probably take a second, but, you know, that's fine. Click OK. It's going to keep copying, keep copying, and boom, there you have MC Patcher and Optifine. After that, we need to go back and then do the same thing for both the Meta Imp folder right here. So let's go back, let's go back, eh, go into it, Meta Imp, and then copy this over, and yes, we want to replace it. Last but not least, you have this Optifine folder right here. Oops, sorry, I clicked out of it. Let me go back into it. You have this Optifine folder, simply drag that over, and then boom. There you go. Finally, after all that time, you're done with Optifine. We can close out of that. Now we need to go into too many items. Once you're in too many items, installing it is actually very, very easy. Just drag all of this all the way down to the bottom. It's not letting me select everything. Click this all the way to the bottom. Drag it over. It'll then copy everything. Hit OK. And we actually need to, need to delete the meta-imp folder. So click that, drag it over to here and then it should delete it or make it go away. For some reason it didn't. Right click, and then we need to delete files, yes. And then it should do it. It's gonna be a little bit different because of how it's in Renoir, but there you guys have it, that's that. Now, 
we need to launch the Minecraft launcher. So I'll meet you guys inside the Minecraft launcher. You can close out everything, open the Minecraft launcher. Once you're in the Minecraft launcher, you want to click edit profile and then you want to go to use version. You then want to scroll down until you see release 1.7.5 underscore mods. You want to click that, click save profile, and then click play. It will then launch Minecraft in this 1.7.5 version with your mods. We're going to have Optifine, we're going to have too many items all together, and this will work with every single mod that you install. It may take some time to get used to it, you may go through some trial and error, but if you would like me to install two mods together to help you out, you can't do it, you can't figure it out, you want to see me do it, please let me know in the comment section down below. Every time a new Minecraft version comes out and I'm looking for tutorial ideas, I will come back to this video to see exactly how to do it. So once Minecraft is launched, we can go into Options, Video Settings, and then as you can see, you have all of the Optifine settings, Quality, Animations, everything is here for Optifine. Done, done, all that's already set for me because I had Optifine installed before. But then we can go into Single Player, we can go into Crisis Craft, or any world that you so choose, it doesn't matter, and then we can hit E, and you guys will see that too many items is actually installed as well and you have successfully installed two mods at the same time in Minecraft and there it is too many items Wow wasn't that a journey I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please give it a thumbs up it really does help me out also subscribe if you haven't already I make awesome Minecraft videos and tutorials and everything every single day of the week that you will enjoy and you'll want to come back to see them. So nevertheless, guys, again, hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Give it a like. Let me know in the comment section down below if you want to see me do specific mods. For example, if you want to see me do the Cape mod and you want to see me do Optifine together, I can happily do that for you. Just let me know what the two mods are and I will check those out and maybe do a video. I will also let you know if I do a video, by the way. I'll, I'll link it and all that awesome stuff. Stuff just for you. Anyway, guys, I'm Nick's Games. Hope you enjoyed this video, and I'm out. Peace. And here's some videos you guys might want to go check out. On the left is how to install texture packs in Minecraft 1.7.9. If you want to know exactly how to install texture packs in Minecraft, go check out that video. And the same goes for the thing on the right, but that is with custom maps, and that video will show you how to install those in Minecraft 1.7.9 as well. Also, check out my daily vlogs and the bomb center of your screen to check out my life every single day. And I'm I am Nick's Games. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'm out. Peace.